Hi guys, Ryu here with Narrative for Blender and let me show you how to quickly create a circular array with your decals. So let's say that you have a sphere or cylinder or whatever and you want to, to create a circular array of your decals. So let's, you know, drop a decal on this um, space here and let's go to hard ops and, you know, click control click on this radial array. Now you can see it will not work because naturally the position and rotation of this decal is shifted because basically the decal usually lands in the middle of the um, of the of the blender um, world so it was misplaced now if i apply you know rotation and transformation uh, everything right scale it will still not work properly so i would need to actually remove the array and rearray it one more time now it works properly, however, there is a problem with it, because we reset the rotation uh, and actually we apply the rotation, if I'm going to, you know, try to project it onto the mesh now, so Alt and Project, you see the projection going to work in a different way, because it's going to go um, across the Z axis, not across the local Z axis, because that axis was reset. So this is not the way to go about it, okay? Now the way to go about it, is um, you add the decal to your scene, right? You apply it to the mesh first. So, you know, you do the adjustments, you, you, you make sure that this is where you want it and you project it with Alt. Now you're gonna get projected properly and you can adjust the height of it and everything you want. Then you apply all transforms, right? And then you array this around your mesh. And now everything is you know working properly so you can still adjust your decals right and you can also you know increase the array still because it's live right so you can go to the uh, array uh, count and simply increase the number of uh, items in your array and there you go you got beautifully arrayed decals around your mesh that's a quick tip from me guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the video if you did give us a like and sub and also as usual, links in the description to hardops and machine stores. If you want to buy these add-ons, go through the links. You're going to help me as well. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next video.